Yo, what up? My name's Don, and today we're going to be checking out the fourth track off Lead From Within's latest album, Shrine. This one's called Flesh and Stone, and there is an official music video as well as a live playthrough that was put on by Neural DSP. So it's going to be really cool to watch them play it live, actually. So without further ado, let's hop right in. Let's see what this one's all about. All right, let's go. Yeah, what an intro, dude. Let's go. Oh, there's the groove, baby. Oh, God, this slaps. Oh man, I felt that transition coming. Let's go. Woo, there's the goosebumps, baby. They're there. Yeah, we're here, baby. We're here. Yo, this video is intense, dude. Oh. Oh, this group brought back the goosebumps group. This is different, man. This is different. Yeah, this is massively different, dude. I was not expecting anything like this. Yo, this song is end of the world epic, bro. This is sick. Dude, that was absolutely incredible. That was absolutely incredible. I guess Clearway Media is maybe the company that did the music video. <laughs> Incredible. I wasn't expecting that at all. It, it sounded like, like, <laughs> that sounded like more like, instead of like, you know, like the last song, um, what was the last song we just said, Levitate? That one was like metal with a bit of like string influence, a bit of orchestral influence with the violin and the cello in it. This one was like more like orchestral from the beginning with just that 
metal on top. It felt like it, it felt like it just felt so, you know, that, that level of epic that an orchestra can reach. I, I feel like it's just kind of, um, special to that, to that genre. You know what I mean? Like, I don't, <laughs> wow, dude, that was incredible. I don't even know. I feel like I should be like fighting the biggest, baddest boss in like Diablo listening to that, you know, like that. I'm really mean end of the world fighting, like, you know, like the skies versus, you know, the heavens versus hell or something like that. That was incredible. That was incredible. So I can't wait to watch the live performance because I know that uh, these guys use uh, neural DSP quad cortexes. I want one so bad because the tone that I've heard come out of these from not only these guys, um, just a ton of other uh, guitarists. Like I'm not, I'm not sure what, um, I'm not sure what Cyalosis uses for their tone, um, but I think it is one of these, you know, digital all-in-one kind of units things. And either way, their tone is just so stupidly crunchy, monstrous, tight, like sick sounding, like, ah, you know, people give me compliments on my tone when I perform live, but like, honestly, this is like where I would like to be tone-wise. Holy cow, dude. All right, let's, uh, hold on a second. Let's watch, let's watch the Neural DSP live playthrough here. Here we go, Flesh and Snow, baby. Oh, that's cool. That's super cool. That that dude. We're we're even gonna get neck cams, bro, bro. Get out of here. That's so sick. We just saw the brand of of uh, Goonzi's guitar too. Car Carolon, Carolion. Dude, I want one of those so bad, dude. Oh, come on, dude. I've never seen anybody except Goonzi play that brand of guitar. Carillion? Yeah, it's really cool how they show you what um, what patch they're using or what effect they're using on the neural DSP itself. Looks like he's using a skinny strap, eh? Is it just me that experiences neck dive with those skinny guitar straps, or is it just like, is it just my guitar? <laughs> Yo, Gunzi loves those those gold accents, eh? It works with his hair too. <laughs> it works with his hair too, right? That's a pretty big GoPro on top of the neck. <laughs> I wonder if it adds any like, you know what I mean? Like I've been thinking about adding that view for my live streams and I think people would like it, but like, yes. So sick, man. I, you know what? It bothers me when, like, I see crowds of any any piece of entertainment. Could be comedy, could be like live bands. When the when the crowds like just kind of like nonchalantly just like, you know what I mean? I'd be sitting like, what? like I'm losing my mind, bro. Carillion. Carillion guitars, dude. Dude, I love the string spread. I know it's like weird nerdy things I'm talking about, but I love the string spread past the locking nut on Goonzi's guitar. You know what I mean? Uh, and Sneb's guitar here. Like, it's such a nerdy thing to, to notice, but like, if you're a guitar player, you know what it is. Yes. I'm gonna have to do a lot of work learning this whole album, dude. You know what, I haven't seen Scott the entire time. <laughs> Where's Scott?
No, seriously, where's Scott? <laughs> oh, there he is. I saw him. I saw him in Snow's camera. He's in the middle right now. <laughs> I would love to know what, what, um, it looks like they're using GoPros, but they're pretty big and the quality is insane. I'm like, I mean, I don't know. I haven't had a, I've never had a GoPro, but, uh, or they look like those tiny DJI cameras. They're huge, bro. That was sick. That was sick. Um, yeah. Once again, their tone is incredible. That song was very cathedral sounding like it was like cathedral metal or something like that you know they i feel like that was a bit of a step away from the, what i feel like is the regular style but super enjoyable nonetheless and i want to see more uh videos of you know like ah, they take their content so seriously i always see like when i'm searching these songs up like snev especially always like almost pretty much always does a playthrough of the songs you know what i mean like it's just incredible just incredible this band's amazing I love that they take their content seriously because as a videographer myself, I love seeing just high quality content. You know, they have a lot of 4K content and even like even Neural DSP. This, this is a video out on Neural DSP's channel. But um, it's cool that there's been a couple of songs where, you know, they collaborate with Neural DSP to, um, I guess, just do a playthrough of their song and, and kind of like. You don't in in most of the playthroughs, you don't really the focus isn't really on the Neural, neural DSP like in Levitate or. I uh, mean, it was one of the other songs and Royalty's piece just sitting there on the ground, but uh, you definitely hear it. You definitely hear it. Right. So uh, for those of us that do play guitar, I was wondering, how did you get that tone? Neural DSP quad cortex, baby. I need one in my life. Um, anyways, I'd love to know what you guys, uh, your favorite parts of this song, um, favorite parts of the music video or the live performance. Um, like I've said, every single video, I'd love to see these guys live. If you've seen them live, let me know down below. And if you want more reactions like this, you enjoy content like this, please like, share, and subscribe as always. And I'll see you in the next one.